story for me, but, you know, the players did that and I could uh, throw a bit of sarcasm in and all that sort of thing. But, you know, really I've forgotten about most of that yeah. sort of thing. I've, I've just been so pleased for the Melbourne Football Club when you get a team that's been out of it for so long, for 23 years, yeah. and you get the players who are just so committed the way these young fellows are at the moment. Uh, I, I just feel tremendously proud of those players and also for bringing all these supporters in. I think it's terrific. Well, it's a long time since I've been in the Melbourne room and there's been as many people out. You probably don't know that, but there's hundreds outside the doors trying to get in and uh, whether or not they, uh, they will, uh, we don't know, but uh, this is a big day for them as well. But uh, well, can you keep it up? Oh, yes, I think so. I, I thought had we got over today, you know, which was a big test for us, you know, the Sydney Swans have been a very good side up until maybe three weeks ago. We couldn't afford to, to let them get back into the game, but, you know, we won that fairly well. But I believe uh, the way the players are playing, you know, we, we're, we're a big show to do anything now because they... They have a lot of confidence in one another and a lot of understanding there and uh, you know even though we've thrown a lot of young fellows into the fray uh, they've all done the job very well because they all know they're really playing for their place.